Hey guys, I'm Mr. Silly Jr. here, aka Mustache Time. Welcome back to the Ghost of Tsushima. Last time we got banished uh, for doing the second push because we ghosted too good. That was. Uh... My lord, please help. Hold on. Over here. Hold on. Let's talk to the. Terrible things are happening along the roads in Sago, my lord. The Mongols are skilled in using terror to control people. This was more than that. I saw them hang a man from oh the boy. trees while his father watched. Woo! I still hear his father screams. I'll find them before they harm any others. Let's get that, uh, armor. The Mongols forced my master to craft a set of armor for Kotun Khan himself. Ooh. He's to conquer our home. He has to steal from my people as well. When my master finished his creation, he saw a chance to run. He fled with the armor. Where did he take it? He hid two pieces of it on different farms, far apart from each other. And the others? The Mongols got them. Of course. Master before he did the rest. When he refused to tell them where to find the missing parts, they executed him. I'll find every piece of that armor. Avenge your master's death. He'd be honored for you to wear the armor, my lord. Bring the pieces back to me, and I'll be sure they fit you properly. Nice. Fit for the Khan. We're about to get some Khan armor. Khan! Maintain. <laughs> Let's go, not noble. <laughs> I can't believe it. I really did in my horse in last time, too. A oh, harrowing uh, escape. Now we're just in pure white land. Holy moly. Talk about changing the aesthetic completely. It's quite the uh, shift, if you will. Cold. To stay warm. All right, let's move in at our location. Seem like a good idea. Where to go? Let's try going around, shall we? Ow. Whoopsie doodle. Ow. 
God damn it. I'll just leave you be. Don't mind me. All right, so far so good. Ghost meter has been filled. Excellent. Slaughter. That's different. Well, I mean, that was effective. Alrighty. Let's uh, work our way around. Thank <laughs> you. 
Thank you. What? What? You didn't say nothing, shut up. Uh oh. Ooh. Saw that quick shot. In house, I want my son. Nogo Samurai Chin Nam Song Tabel. Thank you. We. Ungan. In traditional Mongol mythologies, it is believed that after death, all shamans become wandering spirits on or, or Ungan. It is customary to construct uh, consecrated idols within the three years of the shaman's death and either place them in the home um, Ogan, or in the outdoor shelters. Field Ongan. Neat. Conversations with the Khan 8. Kotan senses a potential rift formed between the ghost and Lord Shimura. While I expressed doubt, he assured me that the Empire has long had long lost experience with such proud warriors. He said to me, Dazio, there is nothing easier th than to prey upon the vanity of ambitious men. People say my grandson Genghis Khan conquered the world because his armies are stronger, faster, and more ruthless than those who opposed him. Nonsense. 
Ruthless men make ev war everywhere. Genghis knew how to befriend enemies and turn his enemies against one another. That is what Lord Shimra and his nephew do not grasp, but I will teach them. May Kent Gunnam grant mercy to anyone who opposes this man. I guess I'm going this way now. He just fucked off. Some very well, you shall come get some. <laughs> I wonder. Piece of Mongo armor. A piece of Mongo armor custom built for Koto Khan, found in Dokchun's mining camp. Easy enough. No, it's not the same. Yeah. 
Hey. It's quite a distance. Guess we'll just go. Wee. Ow. Oh, add that to the counter. How many times I've done that to a horse. Poison dart, pick stuff up, might as well. These guys are smarter. They don't stick to just the roads. Oop. I have no interest in fighting currently. I have a long distance to trek. There. Awesome. Pick up my hallucinogens. I can't pick up any more. Some good distance, all right. You have to get rid of them. Alright, fine, I'll get rid of them. Not yet. It's too dangerous. Give me some. 
You are the samurai who killed so many Mongols with poison. Yeah. I'd given up hope before you came. You see, sir. Yeah, you freaking out over there? You, sir? Sir? Oh, there you go. Freaking out, it's okay. <laughs> Fight, fight, fight. Oi, we don't get to have that. Yeah, go. The good way. Next house. Referring to Oh Negu Harsinta A huge wish wish. <laughs> Again. 
Yeah, yeah. Please stay alive. Thank you, my lord. You're safe now. Two more, huh? <laughs> going on over there. He's chilling. Well, that was unfortunate for you. You bad. Sorry about that. Where could the last hostage be? Thank you. 
He's still leaking off. Oh, I feel bad. Didn't even know I hit him. The dog goes, huh? Oh, it's you too. I'm the ladder. <laughs> there you go. I'm getting to you, buddy. Relax. Over here. Let's go. My lord, I think you were destined to come here. This piece of armor was given to us by the Mango Maid. Hey. It was being the Mongols. This was crafted for Kotan Khan. Now I'll be the one to wear it. Thank you for keeping it safe. Of course, my lord. Piece of Mongol armor. A piece of Mongol armor custom built for Kultukan found in Kachui Farmstead. Yes. Ah, the horse. It's poorly modeled. My lord. Something very strange is going on in Sago Mill. Mongols? I don't know. Everyone walks around as though they're living in the Thousand Hells. But they say nothing is wrong. Sounds as though something is very wrong. <laughs> I'll look into it. Of course. Come on, horse. Gotta get me to point A to point B.
Gotta get me that armor set, baby. Big snow. Wind, push the snow for me. Guide me to your proper ways. Uh, you guys have fun with that. Don't let me get in your way. Oh, here comes another one. Yeah. Two in one video. Doing great, guys. Doing great. All right, time to sneak about. if I do. Thank you, Jacinta. You saw nothing. That's right. Go back to whatever you were doing. I'll just sneak on from the other side. Thank you. You are free now, little one. Yep. <laughs> Uh. 
again, sorry about that. Yo, hear that shit. You want it? Get it, dog. Hello. Conversations with the Khan 9. I cannot imagine the burden of leader Koto, like Koto Khan must bear in an act of utter barbarity. The ghost poisoned the Khan's men in Castle Shimura. Far from deterring, deterring for his own use, he tells me that this is one of the secrets of the Emperor's success. Embracing the rather than rejecting or dominating the might and knowledge of their and antagonist. They, then yesterday I saw what he had done to the people of Kin. I don't know what the, that I'll recover from that sight. I don't know what I, what I think of Kotan. Perhaps great men share all the aspects of their le lessers, but more great wisdom, but even greater cruelty. All right. 
Alrighty. Another one? You want some of this? You sure? I don't think you know what you're in for, good guy. Good sir. Well, alright, he pulled his sword, you know what that means. armor. There we go. Oh, hey, buddy. New buddy. Trying to warm my affections early on, I see. Quite a ways away. We've got to travel, it seems. Away we go! We're just traveling this island. Right quick. We'll get to these smaller parts eventually. It's good for uncovery and short travel for later, but gotta do that initial travel first. A fox. I'll worry about that later. Onward to victory. And armor sets. I have more pressing matters than whatever that was behind me. Get in there. Yeah, so far, it's been pretty easy. I'm assuming this is another farm. Oh, 
looks to be. Ooh. A brewery. Not too smart, let's see. I'm forever indebted to you. I'm safe now. Don't worry about it. Absolutely can help us! They're not suffering! Don't you hurt? Dick Staple Gun stuff! I had a troll! Oh, the god of Yeah, yeah. I've given up hope before you came. Go. Let's be safe. Let's check over here. Hey. 
Sen ne gibi mutlusun? Ha? Orhun da ata. Ata hep bakma. Sen harvaç ver. Elin bende su harvaç ver. What the fuck? Oh, that's a bit cheap. No problem. Easy. Thank you for saving us, my lord. We were given this piece of armor and asked to protect it. But I think it's much safer in your care. Right. This was meant for Mount Khan. I had no idea. Thanks to you, the Mongol will ever wear it. That's every piece of Mongol armor. Piece of Mongol armor. She returned to the apprentice. People shall return, knowing peace was restored. We all know what I need to do next. Well, first I gotta get back here and do this. And then instead of doing the main quest, we gotta do that, uh, finally get that fire sword. Jim, over here. Hold on. My lord, did you find the armor? 
the enemy will never wear your master's work. And the Mongols paid for his death. It eases my pain to know his killers won't hurt anyone else. I just wish I could learn from him one last time. You can teach others. Hooray! I'll take an apprentice. Make sure my master's technique lives on. Here, let me adjust the fit. <laughs> Look at me, I'm a Mongol now. Mongol commander's armor. Conqueror's mask. Mongol Hammond. What would my uncle think if he saw me in this? Nope. Still exiled, though. So many armors. Oh, no upgrades. Okay. Alrighty. I think we can leave it there, and then we will, once we come back, we will learn about this uh, mystic armor. If you ended up enjoying this part, then please feel free to like, comment, and subscribe. Also, make sure to check out those links in the description. One to head over to my Discord server, the other to my Patreon page. Any donations are greatly appreciated. Until next time, everyone. Bye-bye.